patriotic paint stick decor. Hi guys, I'm Kristen and welcome to Studio Knit. I'm coming to you today from my family's beach house here in Northern California. We're having a reunion, both to celebrate Independence Day here in the US, as well as our parents' 50th wedding anniversary. So it is going to be a really special time for our family. I also am getting together with fellow Kin community creators for this video. We're having a block party as it were. Francesca Garza, Weelicious, Karina Stewart, we are all getting together to share some really fun 4th of July holiday ideas for you. So make sure to check them out after this video. And let's get started. Our patriotic paint stick decor. It can be used as a wall hanging, trivet, or even a placemat. It's a project that family members of all ages and abilities will have fun making together and showing off for years to come. Upcycling old paint stick stirrers, and even those chopsticks you have sitting in the junk drawer in your kitchen, we are going to make up the base of our new crafty flags. For our materials, we have wooden paint sticks, and mine are 14 inches in length, and we're going to use about seven or eight per flag. Wooden chopsticks, a glue gun with glue sticks, and paint brushes. I'm traditional for paint and I'm using sponge for my decoupage. You can use Mod Podge or even just regular craft glue. We have acrylic paint, papers, any lightweight papers like wrapping paper or I have some origami paper, it works great. And little star embellishments. You can get crafty using adhesive rhinestones, starfish, even old buttons. Oh, and if you are new to my channel, welcome. This is the place where you will learn how to knit and totally fall in love with it. So make sure to hit subscribe and keep watching for lots of fun ideas coming up this summer. Starting with our first paint stick, we are just going to put on some acrylic paint and go ahead and brush it on however you'd like. I'm going to give mine a little bit extra depth and dimension here by sort of piling up my paint and adding in some black and white to give it a bit of a vintage feel. And to decoupage, just take your paper, cut it into strips, and then with either your Mod Podge or your glue, sponge it on and place it right there on the front of your paint stick and then on the back, fold it down after you have added another layer of Mod Podge. And that is going to hold right there. And then on the top and the back, we are just going to smear our Mod Podge all over it and let it dry. Once we have all of our paint sticks created how we'd like, line them up and then flip them over the opposite way right here because we are going to use our upcycled chopsticks and glue them in place right here on the back. And this completes the base of our flag. It's super simple. It looks really cute on the wall or we can use it as a placemat. And now we'll just finish it off with our stars. I have rhinestones using some buttons. Crafty stars and some starfish. So I hope you're inspired to have some crafty family fun this summer and make sure to watch all of my fellow Kin community creators. There's lots of fun ideas for you and I'll see you next time. Bye.